screencast will teach you about the seven parent functions that we will use to do translations. The first parent function is y equals x. Now we all know this to be a line passing through the origin with a slope of positive 1. And if we look at this graph, we can see that the domain of this function is going to be all real numbers, and the range is also all real numbers. Our second parent function is y equals x squared. This is the parabola. And again, we would recognize this graph. It looks like the letter u. And this parabola is opening up with the vertex at 0, 0. If we look at this graph, we can see the domain is, again, all real numbers. And the range is all y values greater than or equal to 0. Our third parent function is y equals square root x. You may or may not have seen this graph before. And the graph looks like this. The domain of y equals square root of x, as you can see, is x values that are greater than or equal to 0. And our range values are numbers that are also greater than or equal to 0. Our next parent function is y equals x cubed, graph of which looks like this. It looks kind of like the letter S, some people think. The domain of y equals x cubed is all real numbers. And the range of y equals x cubed is all real numbers. Our fifth parent function is the function y equals 1 over x, the graph of which looks like this. It's a rational function. It comes in two pieces. And you have an asymptote here on the y-axis, meaning the graph will get very, very close to it, but it will never touch the y-axis. And you also have an asymptote on the x-axis. The graph will get very, very, very close to the x-axis, but never touch it. So the domain for y equals 1 over x is going to be all real numbers, but x cannot equal 0. Because if you put 0 in for x, you get division by 0, 1 over 0, and that is undefined. The range of this function, again, is going to be all real numbers, but y will never take on the value of 0. Our next function is y equals 1 over x squared. The graph of that looks like this, similar to 1 over x, but you can see that both of the pieces are above the x-axis. Again, we have an asymptote on the y-axis. So a graph will get very, very close to the y-axis, but never touch it. And we also have an asymptote here on the x-axis. Our graph will get very, very close to the x-axis, but never touch it. Our domain is all real numbers, again, but x cannot equal 0. And our range is going to be all y values strictly greater than 0. Our last parent function is y equals the absolute value of x. And the graph looks like the letter v. The domain of this function is all real numbers. And the range is y values greater than or equal to 0. For each of these parent functions, you should recognize the equation form, what the graph looks like, and know the domain and the range.